Hi, I'm Liam. I'm into pro wrestling, beer, hip hop, and women. Back in high school, my guidance counselor told me that I learned differently from a lot of folks. Nowadays, things are going great with my job at the garage. With my love life, not so much. For a while, I was dating Gita. We met in high school. When we decided we wanted to try having sex, we went to a youth clinic. They had free condoms, and Gita even got free birth control pills because she was under 21. But then her mom found them, and we weren't allowed to date anymore. I wish we'd just use condoms instead of condoms and pills both. Condoms are easier to hide, but we wanted to be as safe as possible. I told her family that, but they were still mad. They thought we were just friends. Have you ever had conflicts because of dating or relationships like Liam has? My favorite place to get information about sex is at the youth clinic. I hate reading and I don't like talking on the phone. At the youth clinic, I can talk to someone face to face, either a doctor or a nurse about birth control and safer sex, or to a counselor about how I'm feeling. Meeting women interested in dating has been really tough. Sometimes I try to meet women at the mall, but usually they're mean to me. I've tried a dating group for people with cognitive disabilities in Vancouver called Let's Get Real. It was all right, but it's too far from me. There's also pro wrestling shows at a nearby community center that I want to check out sometime. Maybe I could meet someone there. How about you? Do you want to date anyone? How do you meet people? I've also started to talk with others like me about this stuff. I started going to Real Talk pizza parties. They're run by a sexual health educator, and I can ask them questions in the group or privately afterwards. Do you ever have questions about sex? Yeah, I masturbate, and yeah, I look at porn. Pornhub.com is free, and as long as you stay on that site, you don't wind up accidentally clicking on anything illegal. Someone told me about sensual solutions, where you get to do sexual things with someone called an intimacy coach. It's pretty expensive, though, when you're only making minimum wage. Do you get to feel sexual pleasure in your life? Liam was voiced by John Woods. The narrator was voiced by Kelsey Savage. Music is Happy Rock by BenSound.com. Original illustrations by Julia Bonforte. For a paper version of this comic, links to all the resources Liam uses, and more videos of open conversations on dating, love, relationships, and sex, visit real-talk.org.